Hi, Chris from Battlegoat Studios. Just another feature I wanted to talk about today was the connection that we have between the space dock that orbits the planet and the space port that can be built on the planet. At the beginning of the game, your homeworld has a space dock in its first space production that your faction has just started to explore your system and you're able to build some more ships. The space port is really about trade and flow of goods. So it doesn't start on your home world for stuff the story explains a little bit. But once you've built that spaceport, this makes the merchant AI, this faction that moves around commodities, makes them more aware of you and they start offering you diplomatic offers. But long term, part of our plan is to connect the spaceport on your planet and the space dock in orbit for the movement of troops so that you can easily with multiple spaceports on the planet level, send tanks and artillery and infantry to the space ports, have those units transferred to the space dock, and have one transport ship in orbit, pick up all the units you need as you head out with an invasion force. So we've been working on this mechanic, getting the user interface pieces up and running, that right now, if you have a transport ship with units and it goes into reserves, well, your units kind of get trapped in the space dock. So we almost have the user interface ready to go. So you'll be able to get those full controls and be able to move around all of those units and head out through the galaxy to take over whoever you can. So if you've been playing the game, make sure you have the latest update. We post change logs every time that we push a fast track or a public build and let us know what you're thinking of the game. We love getting all the feedback. Bye.